नमस्कार गुड मॉर्निंग माई सर डॉक्टर गौरव झावड़ा आई एम अ डायरेक्टर ऑफ मधुदीप आई एफ एंड गेस्ट बेबी हॉस्पिटल और मोबाइल नंबर इज नाइन सेवन वन फोर एट सिक्स फोर सिक्स डबल फोर टूडे आई वॉन्ट टू डिस्कस रिगार्डिंग वेरी इम्पोर्टेंट टॉपिक एंड ए वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग टॉपिक सो इट इज वेरी हॉट टॉपिक टूडे इट इज वॉट प्रिकॉशन शूड बी टेकन आफ्टर ट्रांसफर ऑफ एमरियो और एमरियो ट्रांसफर सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी आर डूइंग मोक इट इन एवरी पेशन सो रिएशन must done before starting the cycle so we can know the proper canal cervical and uterine canal so we can properly put the embryo second thing uh, if any problem or like a patient is a some non discomfort then we can also advise for the general anesthesia or short ga for that purpose after embryo transfer we advise for 3 hours of rest and after that you can travel and go to your destination it's advisable second thing you can eat everything like roti sabji chawal rice vegetables and fruits we advise for avoid non veg food and spicy food like garlic and onion and uh, um, these are the some of the thing which we avoid during the post transfer period we advise for use the uh, western common avoid the relation and uh, please avoid the stress so uh, these are the basic thing which you should know during your transfer period second thing which are the medicine which prescribed by the doctor after transfer of the embryo so some of the medicine are progesterone which is in capsule form or in oral form which is 200 mg in dose you should take in the morning afternoon and in the evening vaginally orally or like intramuscularly second thing is estrogen which is a 2 mg in dose you should take it Uh, one studious or two studious or according to your doctor advice this is a estrogen estrogen in two form first is a estrogen valerate and which is a second one is a hemihydrate nowadays hemihydrate is more popular than the uh, valerate in same manner progesterone also used in two manner orally or vaginally and third thing we use is dihydrogestrone which is a 10 mg uh, tablet it should be used in the once or twice generally but if advised then we can also use one bd or one td which is over table third one is the injectable progesterone which is generally 100 mg or 200 mg nowadays to relieve the painless injection also available which is known as aqueous based injection or you can use the oil based injection fourth one is the hcg injection 5000 hcg or recombinant hcg can be used uh, subcutaneously or intramuscularly every 5 day or 3 days in some patient we also advise for the interglo or varglo low molecular heparin ecosporin tablet or some of the other drug which is useful for during this transfer period uh, l methylfolate 1 mg also advisable to prevent the congenital malformation so after that which uh, uh, work uh, we advise to do after transfer that you can regularly go to your office you can drive a scooter or motor you can do your household all the work you can cook you can wash and you can take your daily activities regularly you can also climb a stair or go to the garden these are the all the thing you can permit it during this period but avoid a relation and like in a common so this is the basic thing after that you should also know that every drug which your doctor is prescribed to you is uh, very important so please don't skip any drug or injection in post transfer period if your blood report it is known as a beta hcg report which is a uh, hcg hormone when it is increase or spike there is a confirmation of pregnancy happen so that time you should do a beta hcg report which is generally advisable after 15 days and if it is more than 100 million 100 enters in it then there may be chances of uh, you get the pregnancy uh, in case you get more than 100 uh, enters in it hcg then uh, your doctor or we advise for ultrasound in ultrasound doctor will confirm uh, how many g sac or how many embryos are implanted and then you can go to your regular doctor for routine checkup so this is the basic so what precaution and what should be done in embryo transfer period or post transfer period if you have any query you can direct contact us uh, i think
uh, we should discuss what are the drug which is used in post transfer period so uh, we will make a video tomorrow for that myself dr gaurav chaudhary on behalf of medical uh, madhudeep idf and uh, test tubing center uh, very thankful because of patiently hearing my world talk and our mobile number is 9714864644 our website is www.madhudeepbio.com jai hind jai bharat vande mataram we will meet uh, tomorrow with another new video and new episode till then bye bye please watch our video carefully because these all are practical advice uh, you don't know in other video or in theory books so and these are the genuine advice which we use in our day to day practice so till then bye bye namaste